I don't think Israel regards itself as an occupying force, but whether that is correct, I would want to take legal advice, because this comes to this issue about aid, where I think Israel needs to do more, a lot more, to get more aid into Gaza, which perhaps we can come on to. And forgive me, we know that Israel does not consider itself to be an occupying yeah. power, but British law currently does consider Gaza to be an occupied power. Can you, uh, oh, sorry, an occupied territory. Can you just confirm that on the record? I, I, I don't know the precise legal definition of that. I'd have to go back and check. Philip? I think I'm, we all know I'm, that the Foreign Office does know what the official legal position is. We, 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 describe, we describe the territories as the occupied Palestinian territories, but oh, that's, that's a, a different question. That's a descriptor. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. We should give you the, a piece of a written advice on the legal position. I think what the Chair is asking is, do we consider Gaza to be occupied militarily at the moment? Is that what you're getting at? I'm asking for the, Br the British government's legal definition, whatever they consider to be the terminology of that you occupy, because as I understand it, there is no question that in law, under British law, and according to the UN Security Council Relation 23334, on which we have based our legal position, Gaza is an occupied territory.